Hey, let's talk about this list. We do not make this list ourselves. We have a well-educated group of researchers who look at the internet and see what the net says is the best of or sometimes the worst of anything then we compile it and give it to you, the viewer. Upon this research, someone said they liked both versions of Hercule Goes to New York, but it is the same movie, so I took liberty and changed that myself to talk about a Hercules movie that is quite well a good now. Without further commenting, here is an updated countdown. And I don't wish to hear another word on the subject. Featuring Hercules films. The top 20 Hercules film adaptations. 20. Hercules Against the Moon Men, 1964. This campy sword and sandal flick pits Hercules against alien invaders. The ridiculous premise and low budget effects are part of the charm or the cringe. Aliens? Really? This Hercules was on another planet, literally. Reddit comment. What did Hercules say when he conquered a lion? Man, this gig is positively exhausting. I love my job. <laughs> 19. Hercules in New York, 1970. Arnold Schwarzenegger's debut film is unintentionally hilarious, with a poorly dubbed voiceover and a fight with a bear in Central Park. It's a so bad. It's good's cult classic. The only thing Herculean about this movie is my effort to sit through it. Tumblr reviewer. 18. Hercules Reborn, 2014. This direct-to-video mess tries to be gritty, but ends up as dull as a blunt sword. WWE star John Morrison does his best, but even his muscles couldn't lift this uninspired script. The only thing reborn here is my regret for watching. YouTube comment. 17. The Legend of Hercules, 2014. Starring Kellen Lutz, this film struggles to find its footing as it borrows liberally from 300 and Gladiator. The visuals are flashy, but the story is paper thin. If abs could act, this would win an Oscar. Quora user. 16. Hercules and the Tyrants of Babylon, 1964. Hercules faces off against tyrannical rulers. While ambitious in concept, the execution is sluggish. Bonus points for the epic title, though. Babbling tyrants, more like Reddit user. How did Hercules react when he saw his first Hydra? Great. Now I have to kill it seven more times. 15. Hercules and the Amazon Women, 1994. Kevin Sorbo's TV Hercules takes on a village of warrior women. While entertaining, it feels more like a cheesy 90s sitcom with swords than an epic adventure. Sorbo's mullet is the real hero. Tumblr critic. 14. Hercules Against the Sons of the Sun, 1964. An attempt to mix Greek mythology with Incan culture, this film goes all in on cultural mashups. It's unique, but often confusing. Hercules meets the Aztecs? Sure, why not? Quora commenter. Why did Hercules go vegan? Because he was tired of wrestling beef with every monster. 13. Hercules and the Masked Rider, 1963. Hercules meets a Zorro-like hero in this offbeat tale. It's as bizarre as it sounds, but worth a watch for its novelty value. Hercules with a cape-wearing buddy? Sign me up for this chaos. I am DB user. 12. Hercules in the Haunted World, 1961. This Mario Bava-directed film features Hercules battling supernatural forces. The moody visuals make up for its sometimes clunky pacing. Haunted houses and Hercules? Spooky Swole. Tumblr fan. 11. The Adventures of Hercules, 1985. Lou Ferrigno returns in this sequel filled with flashy effects and hammy acting. It's peak 80s cheese with enough biceps to keep it entertaining. So many lasers, so little sense. YouTube viewer. Why did Hercules become a stand-up comedian? Because he was tired of carrying the weight of the world. He wanted to drop some punchlines instead. 10. Hercules, 1957. Steve Reeves' performance set the standard for Hercules films. This one's a solid classic, though its age shows in the storytelling. The original Sword and Sandal King. Redditor. 9. The Three Stooges Meet Hercules, 1962. A comedy classic where slapstick meets mythology. It's ridiculous and delightful if you're a fan of the Stooges. A crossover no one asked for, but everyone needed. IMDb Reviewer. 8. Hercules in the Maze of the Minotaur, 1994. Kevin Sorbo's Hercules faces his most iconic monster yet. While a TV movie, 
It delivers solid action and drama for its budget. Sorbo's Herc is the Minotaur slaying king. YouTube comment. How does Hercules relax after a long day? He enjoys a nice Herculate at Olympus Cafe. 7. Hercules 1983. Hercules 1983 is a campy, action-packed retelling of the classic Greek myth, starring bodybuilder Lou Ferrigno in a title role. Directed by Luigi Cosi, this Italian production blends mythology with sci-fi elements, featuring Hercules battling robotic creatures, cosmic gods, and mythical beasts in a quest to save the world and his true love. Known for its over-the-top special effects, dazzling, and sometimes baffling visuals and Ferrigno's Herculean physique, the film is a cult favorite among fans of 80s sword and sandal epics. It's a bold, bizarre, and delightfully cheesy take on the legendary demigods' adventures. Hercules, 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 Hercules. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up and join the crew by subbing and clicking the bell. 6. The Loves of Hercules, 1960. Nikki Hargitay stars in this colorful epic featuring Hercules battling a Hydra. Campy, fun, and pure sword and sandal nostalgia. The Hydra stole the show. Tumblr reviewer. 5. Hercules and the Circle of Fire, 1994. Kevin Sorbo's TV Herc faces trials and tribulations in this surprisingly emotional entry. It's one of the stronger TV movies in the series. Sorbo brought the fire. Reddit user. 4. Hercules and Xena, the animated movie, 1998. A nostalgic 90s throwback featuring the legendary Kevin Sorbo and Lucy Lawless. It's campy but heartwarming for fans of the TV shows. Xena and Herc teaming up? Yes, please. Tumblr user. Why did Hercules retire? Because he realized lifting the sky was a bit over his weight limit. 3. Disney's Hercules, 1997. A fan favorite with catchy songs, witty humor, and memorable characters like Meg and Hades. It's a heroic musical masterpiece. Zero to Hero, a cinematic treasure. IMDb Commenter 2. Hercules 2014 Dwayne Johnson reinvents the hero with a gritty, action-packed take on the myth. His charm and charisma make this a standout modern adaptation. The Rock IS Hercules Redditor 1. Hercules Unchained 1959 Steve Reeves' second outing as Hercules is the definitive sword and sandal epic. Filled with drama, intrigue, and epic battles, it's the pinnacle of Hercules cinema. This is the Herculean standard. Quora user. That's the countdown. Did your favorite make the list? Or do you have another Herculean gem in mind? Please. Oh, I want to sleep. Let me know. And remember, if anyone can carry these rankings, it's your internet girlfriend, Ava. Two hearts. Who's your daddy?